Yo, what's up and what's going on guys? It's your boy Michael here, back from the video on my channel. And today, I'm going to be showing you guys a fully automated Enderman farm. Alright, so a lot of you guys have been asking me in the comment section. You guys keep asking whether some of the mob grinder I show is compatible with Enderman. But most of them are not. Even if that works, it's not as efficient as the one that I'm going to show you. So it's very simple and very efficient, I promise you, and very easy to make. So without further ado, let's get straight right into the video. So right here, this is the automated enderman farm so the concept is very simple so basically if you guys don't know the enderman in skyblock i'm not sure if that works originally in vanilla as well at least for skyblock the enderman will teleport back to its original location where he took the damage whatever they do they'll still go back to the original place and then eventually die from suffocating so i'm gonna show you guys closely to this farm all right so this is the farm right here we only make it to feed one minion so far and i think it's working perfectly fine basically once again this is not my design my friend made it and since you guys been asking me to show you guys uh an automated mob grinder specifically for enderman then here it is basically it's just like a normal cage like one of this cage i made so basically it is a uh, five times five inside and then a seven times seven outside and the height for this specific farm you need to follow exactly what i said so basically you're gonna build either four blocks or three blocks high for a third block you have to put a full block or a slab because if you guys don't know endermans are three blocks high so basically if you only give them two blocks they will end up suffocating that's the concept of this mob grinder all right on the floor you have to put hopper everywhere just so you can ensure that every single ender pros drop from the enderman are picked up and not wasted and you can just link all these hoppers to one chest and then slowly transfer them down here just so you have extra storage if you want to afk for a few hours maybe this chest will fill up and the pros only stack up to 16 each stacks so you can make it bigger by maybe extending it another three blocks and then base like two blocks between each minions and then put another one and maybe make it this way and then space another two blocks as well then you can make it like up to four minions or something just extend it slightly and remember the third blocks put a block and there you go so yeah by the way guys after wednesday which is the last subject for my final then i'll be back on grind like uh, maybe daily streaming, daily upload. I'm going to have a 3 weeks semester break. And I'm gonna use this 3 weeks to be as productive as possible. Alright, so anyways guys, thank you guys so much for watching this video. And I'll see y'all in my next video. Peace out and have a nice day.